everybody. I wanted to show y'all something, just a little quick tutorial here on how I use the standard embroidery hoops that come with commercial machines. How I hoop pocketed t-shirts with these. I found a neat little trick. Um, a lady that does uh, quilting in her embroidery machine she suggested this um, during one of her tutorials and I applied that to hooping the t-shirts. I do not have the magnet hoops or the hoop master systems um, yet so I had to make do with what I got and I wanted to show y'all a quick and easier way to do this. Now everybody who's done any kind of hooping and trying to get it on a left chest logo area or whatever and get it lined up, you're sitting there, your problem that you have is you got your hoop in here, you got the back in here, and you're sitting here trying to square it up and make sure everything's just all lined up and then you get it, you get it mashed down in there and you just crick it. I don't know how, I've spent 30 minutes who trying to hoop one t-shirt before and I, I just get frustrated with it. But I've applied this, I heard this the other day and I applied it Oh my gosh, this is better than sliced bread. But the simple thing that we have is this awesome stuff right here. This is removable double-sided tape. And what I do, I also have on my table here, it might be in the way a little bit, but we'll see if we can get it to work. I have this uh, laser alignment light. Oh, I love it. All right. I don't know if you can see this in the camera. I believe you can, yeah. All right. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm my uh, design that I have for these, um, these shirts have two lines of text, and they go about three-quarters of an inch above the center line of the pocket here. All right, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you. I take a hoop, and I put about four pieces of the double-sided tape on the um, hoop, the bottom of the hoop. This turns around, and then I, what I do is I line this up. Okay. Excuse the thunder we have outside right now. So I have, I make sure that this pocket is lined up right there on that line, just right there at the edge. Then I take this and I make sure that those laser lines, getting pretty close here, totally line up with my marks that are on my hoop. Okay. That's pretty close, and then I stick it down. And what that does is it helps it not move. And I can sit here and I can take this lower hoop and I can match it up to the top one. Okay, I've expanded my hoop a little bit at the bottom. I also, um, I forgot to tell you, when I did these shirts, I hooped or I stuck to the back for stabilizer. I stuck two layers of poly mesh no-show stabilizer. It works the best on these shirts, and I get very rarely do I get any puckering. Okay, see? You can see here by the line, I've got it lined up here. It's pretty stable across there, and we have it lined up in our shirt here. All right, if y'all have any questions, um, Feel free to make a comment, and thanks for watching.